Hi everyone, I'm gonna be reorganizing my bookshelf today. A lot of books and a lot of Funko Pop and Lego sets. Top section. I don't like how these three books are right here because it's kind of sticking out and I don't like that. So we're gonna remove this from the top shelf. I feel like I don't have enough, enough books here, but not only this Lego set right here is very fragile. It is a Star Wars Lego set. Definitely want to add more books to this section, but the only thing is this Harry Potter Lego set, books can easily knock down these pieces. Do it like this. I have to turn this the other way. It can match, but obviously this will be upside down unless I turn it upside down like this. But I don't really like how that looks. I'd rather it be like this. I keep breaking Lego sets. Oh God. I have this Winnie Pooh Lego set and the thing is it opens up and closes. So I kept it closed because I don't have enough room to open it. It falls apart really easily. As you can see, I'm holding a piece right now and I don't know where this goes. Look at nail. I'm not trying to flip you off or anything part has nothing and the reason why is because I need to get three more books from this series right here this Crave series I don't have the first book but for now since obviously I do not have the book I'm gonna fill it up Yu-Gi-Oh box here if it can fit okay I finished organizing my bookshelf. Now we're gonna start packing for my trip. At the end of this month, I'm going to Canada. And yes, it is a little bit too early to pack, but it is okay because I like packing early. And if you guys didn't know, I am doing Vlogmas this year, so I'll be uploading every single day. So my carry-on is on the floor, and I already packed all the gifts. Not all the gifts, but most of the gifts that I need to bring to my friend and for Benji and... Um, Basically, I'm gonna have my carry-on and my duffel bag, and my duffel bag will be filled with like um, necessities and maybe some more gifts. If I so, what I need is at least a week worth of clothes because I'm going from the 19th to the 26th. Right after I come back, I am going to a family dinner. I need to bring some spare clothes just in case, but I don't want to bring too much because I'm going thrifting in Canada. I am basically done with the semester. The only thing I have left is like two final projects and three more exams and one more homework. But I'm gonna do the homework today. Okay, so I just finished making my banner, my intro and outro, and right now I'm about to make some food. But while I make some food, I'm gonna insert clips of what I got from Black Friday. I want to show you guys what I got for Black Friday shopping. A lot of these are actually Christmas gifts, or mo majority of it is Christmas gifts. And I'm gonna show you guys because all my friends basically know what we're getting each other. There's only like a few gifts here and there that we don't know of. We got it's the electric kettle. Um, this is I didn't buy this, so Trish, Phil, and Charles are splitting this for Benji's parents. Next thing is that we went to Ulta Garnier Skin Active Microcellar Cleansing Water Vitamin C All in One Brightening Remove Makeup Cleansing and Glow. Next thing we got is this poo spray for the bathroom because since we're going to Canada, we're gonna be sharing a Airbnb and then. Trish actually paid for this for me because it was like a buy one get one half off. This is the sugar scrub to Barnes and Nobles. 
and I only got one thing from there and I wish I got more but I didn't. I got the Sailor Moon Eternal Edition manga number four. I have one, two, and three. I wanted to get four and five but I decided to just get four today. Target and six wrapping papers. This is actually your free set that they gave us and it's just like a little winter elf scene. Elf elf scene which i'm gonna give to my niece and then um benji and i are splitting gifts for my cousin phil two cars and these were like 20 dollars each the last thing this is the office lego set so benji charles and i split it and bought it for trish 